Hi there, my name is Cayman Farmer, aka The Goofball Prodigy, and if you're watching this, you might have heard of my recent Spotify release, Romance is Dead. It's a song about the evolution of the concept of romance during the technological age that we live in now. And in light of its release, I thought I would ask people all over the world to send us clips under a minute of what they think the sentence Romance is Dead means to them. Anyway... This is a compilation of all those clips along with a few surprises I've put in myself. There's an interval in the middle and a surprise at the end if you stick around. So please do. Anyway, I think the insights people have had have been hopeful and insightful and I think they will help those who need it. So stick around, have a gander, have a listen. This is Cayman Farmer, passing you by. Is dead. What does this saying, line, quote of Cayman's mean to me? It means that Cayman is currently having some problems in the romantic world, the romantic portion of his life. Um, what would it mean personally to me? Romance is dead. It means you know what, I've got so many things I need to do with my life, I've got so many things I need to achieve, and romance is getting in the way. Thinking about boys, it's getting in the way. I need to be moving forwards towards my dreams, and boys and their controlling or mean behaviour gets in the way, or the fact that they just don't like me when I like them. And then, when I have my career goals more set up and I'm really achieving them, and maybe just other things in my life like fitness goals and being happy in general, then maybe I'll find the right guy. So romance is dead for now. Peace, Cayman Farmer. Best wishes from Germany. So, is romance dead? I think romance is like a self supplying entity, like air, and so it just exists. But most people lose touch with it because they are too, distract, too distracted with uh, life or an artificial life that has been created for them. Or, for example, we don't know how to responsibly use phones. So phones or new technology or the content that is provided through such controls our emotions and our thoughts instead of us being able to control ourselves and kind of choose to be in contact with love, creativity or romance in this case. So, but then again through something like Tinder, in the end humans will always end up with humans, whether we meet somebody on the street or through a technological device. So there's always a chance to rediscover the connection to romance. But of course that's that it kind of gets more difficult when the origin is always a distracted mind. So in that case romance is not dead, but most people are dead unfortunately. So let's wake him up with music. Oh. Hi. Romance is dead means that nowadays romance is not appreciated anymore the way it used to be because of how... Well, I honestly don't know why, but it's just not really appreciated anymore by a lot of mainstream society, women and men. Things just aren't done in that type of old school, cute way. And that's okay too, because now a whole new type of romance is emerging, which is just being in the moment and spontaneous, being fun. I think every person is learning that, <laughs> that we all have our own key and we all have our own love language and it's okay 
to be different and it's okay to love each other from different sexes different ages different cultural backgrounds and yeah so romance is not dead to me i don't believe that it is dead i just think it's changing mm, thank you Peace. so what does the sentence romance is dead mean to me it depends what you call romance because We've been together for 45 years and it certainly had its ups and downs. It's not always romance, but uh, it's like life. If you can't always be happy and on top of it and be romantic, sometimes it's just trying to be nice to each other, you know, it changes as the years go by, you know, when you're young, Certain things are important to you, like getting ahead, the children, the different things you fight about and not having time for any romance. Um, you, I guess you get your romance from, you know, having holidays together and, and as much sex as you can have. But as you get older, uh, you know, you can really start to love someone and you can really, because you really know them and your children have left. And I think uh, you have to make the romance because love is not romance and love is what you have when you're older and that's caring about someone. But the romance is, is the icing on the cake. So your turn. Yeah. Well, when I hear the, the term romance is dead, I just keep thinking about how hard it is for young people these days because their whole perception of life is based on a single image, swiping right, swiping left, and what they see in porn videos. But really, that's not how you judge a person. And romance is about caring about someone and wanting to, to share a joy. And it's just really tough for young people these days because they have this expectation that they see on, you know, social media that basically destroys the thought of romance altogether. It confuses what it really is. And what it really is is caring. Yeah. Romance is dead means to me that you're no longer showing love languages such as touch, affirmations, quality time, acts of service, and uh, gifts. But those are essential in a relationship so it's best to express and give and show all of those love languages to your special someone or to your partner so in my conclusion romance is in fact not dead thank you romance is dead what it means to me it means pain it means suffering and total annihilation of the soul. Women, all they want is to lead you on. All they want is to see you suffer and die. They might, they might seem, they might, this is ridiculous. They might, they might seem, okay, they might seem, uh, you know, innocent. I just want to dance. Look at me, I just want to dance. I, oh yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure you're feeling ecstatic about dancing. That's what I want to do! I think, I think my neighbours know where I am. I think I, my neighbours know who I am. And what I've become. They think that they're gonna lead you on and get away with it. Not on my watch. Because I'm coming for you. Ah, I think that romance is in fact not dead uh, and the reason why is because well I don't know maybe the person I was before might have thought um, there's no hope for love in this world I don't think it you know, could ever happen to me especially with the fact I used to be picked on I used to be bullied a lot especially from girls in high school where you, you know they used to call me all kinds of names uh, pathetic wimp 
uh, Piss Boy. Won't even get into that. Mushbrain. Uh, what else? Uh, Yoquin Phoenix's Joker. Yeah. Yeah, that's, I'm gonna laugh at that. <laughs> I'm gonna laugh at that! That's so funny! <laughs> What, yeah, they used to call me all kinds of names. A uh, boy who likes eating uh, maggot trash and, and smelling like sewer filth. But, due to the help of online dating, I have found myself a beautiful woman. And she's not afraid to see me out in public uh, with her, you know. Uh, it's, it's awesome, yeah. And we're having our first date this Friday over Zoom, so looking forward to that. Ah, uh, you know what? I think we're gonna make it. Hang in there, King. I think we're gonna make it. Romance is dead. The show's over then, let's go home. <laughs> I don't think romance is dead. When I hear the phrase romance is dead, I'm, I'm a bit saddened because I do believe that it's one of the things that lends such beauty and joy to our lives and um, I do believe that romance can take many forms as well, right? It doesn't have to be romantic in that sense. It is all the little beautiful pieces of people that we get to love and live and experience. So I don't believe that romance is dead. Romance is dead to me sounds like something you say when you're giving up on love. Maybe you've been hurt one too many times, or it's just been a while since you feel like you've connected well with someone. But that's the thing. It, love and romance just takes time. You don't just meet someone and it immediately happens. It takes a lot of time for romance and love to develop. So love and romance will never die. To me, romance is not dead. It's just taking its time and hopefully one day it just finds its way to our lives. To our lives? Into our lives? But something like that. <laughs> I really liked those entries. I think they deserve a round of applause, don't they? <laughs> That's right. Alright, there is a surprise yet to come, so I hope you stick around for that. But now, just before that happens, I'm going to tell you what the sentence Romance is Dead means to me. The song doesn't mean anything to me, I wrote that three years ago. But, the concept is still current. That I think romance... The idea of romance is entwined with love. And I think these two things, um, they're about long-term validation in the long run. And uh, uh, commitment, and that, and like those real incandescent surprises. But there is um, a technological advances that uh, have changed it, changed and become more quick in validation, and less about the long-term uh, commitment that uh, blossoms into things like true love and courtship. But in saying that, it is not dead because. As long as people exist, the concepts can stay alive and they will continue to manifest themselves for as long as humans are around to perceive it. So it's not dead, but it is changing. And like kindness and hate, and like positive and negative, positive is passive, negative is aggressive, immovable objects and unstoppable forces will always exist. And as the universe moves like yin-yang, these two forces will always equalize each other out. So, as much as there's this lizard brain mindset consumed by technology, there is this other side that will continue to grow alongside it. But as it's passive, you won't notice it so much. But I think love and kindness and sincerity is out there. I'd rather be alone. It's just under the covers. <laughs> Alright, moving on. Thanks for watching.
I like the ground it's all about what we see I hate to romanticize this death of romance That's the irony and it's in the way they dance I say hey girl Oh, we love this out there, friends that under the cover. And the girls want to take me to their beds, but we all know that romance today is dead. Haven't you heard what they said? Romance is dead. Haven't you heard what they said? Romance is dead. Being young, young, being fun, he's just another one. Casualty How the words crumble Just for fun When the kippy girl says Her heart belongs to more than one I'll say if all the Everest That's so glamorous But I don't think that I really want it Want to send me friend requests, but we all know that consciously bad best. And the girls want to take me to the bed, but we all know that romance is dead. They said, romance is dead, can't believe, I want to leave, what they said, I can't believe.